Uh, fibroadenomas are uh, quite common uh, tumors, uh, particularly in uh, young females. Uh, if the treatment is required, uh, the, the generally surgery is uh, performed, but surgery has some uh, limitations. It may cause a, a scar tissue, uh, it may uh, disturb the uh, cosmesis of the breast, and uh, if the fibroadenomas are multiple, uh, these limitations may increase. Uh, an alternative method is uh, cryoablation, and cryoablation has obtained FDA approval in uh, 2002 for uh, the treatment of breast fibroadenomas. And uh, we have been using this method uh, since uh, 2012. Uh, cryoablation has some uh, advantages in uh, breast fibroadenomas. Uh, we, we do the procedure through a, a needle hole. So there is no incision, there is no scar tissue. Uh, the whole procedure can be done under local anesthesia and uh, ultrasound guidance. Uh, the patient is very comfortable, uh, she doesn't feel any pain. And uh, after the procedure is finished, uh, she can return uh, to her normal life uh, immediately. Uh, cryoablation is uh, particularly suitable for multiple fibroadenomas uh, because the treatment of multiple fibroadenomas is uh, difficult. Uh, it, surgery, is, uh, surgery requires multiple incisions, so uh, more damage to breast cosmesis. Uh, but since uh, cryoablation is done through a needle hole, uh, it, it preserves uh, the cosmesis of the breast so it is a very uh, suitable option for multiple fibroadenomas uh, in young patients.